Hey everyone, how's it going? This is QQ Sauce. I'm here playing Colony Survival. I've been having survival issues for a bit now, obviously. Uh, but things are going well. Food is going up. Arrows. Not sure because there is no arrow production at night, but they keep burning through them. I think that I need about 200 arrows per night, as it stands. That might change soon, might not, I don't know. What is that? Mint, get that out of my face. I have two now, great. So, production is going alright. I was gonna make a technologist's table today, so linen bag is what I need. Let's go and have a quick look at the tailoring station. What I require for a linen bag? Not in here. Uh, here. Let's see. Linen bag needs linen. Linen needs flax. Well, we are pretty much there. Um, I suppose we are waiting for. We we don't have flax. We don't have much flax though. Um. <clears throat> Right, we need flax. Let's go have a look at how that's doing. Whoosh. I think it takes a few days to generate. It is very important for the tailoring. And if I want to progress at this game at all. So let's have a look here. How are you doing, man? What's up? What's happening? What is happening? Just sitting here. Flax hasn't grown, I see. I don't want to make two flax farms, mainly because do you know what's gonna happen when I make two flax farms? I'm gonna cap out on flax in two days and then I'll have another flax. Oh, I could always disable that after that, I suppose. Oh no, the night is, night is nearing. We have 80 arrows. Let's make that priority. Just Food is alright now, food is going up. However, however, the arrows are not. And why is that? Let's see. I think the miners are the biggest problem, to be fair, because it seems that my guys are often out of iron to smelt. See? I mean, that's a lot of time wasted here. I think that two smelters might be enough. You're becoming a miner, my friend. You will be a miner tomorrow and... And hopefully... With that, we will resolve this once and for all. I can barely leave uh, the guard posts because of fear that everything is gonna die. Alright guys, I have four dedicated iron miners. Why is this why is this so hard? Why is it so hard to get iron? I need to get up in just a second, but I need to find some more iron. Okay good, I found some. No, not a berry farm. I can't set up a berry farm down here, that's coal, I'll need that soon as well. Anyway, let's go up, not waste too much time down here. Hopefully, hopefully we're nearing a point where things are gonna get self-sustained again. You see, they added just a few mechanics to the game and I need to upgrade and balance everything out again. Which is funny, you know, that's the point of the of this whole thing, but... Should I move my guard here? I think that uh, it's not a good time to move him. Right. Still, I think that the line that I was talking about, where I set up like a bunch of guards in a line to shred everything, might be a good idea. 
and I'll add like a little maze under there. But that will make it incredibly annoying to get back in, so... So yeah, waiting for morning again, <laughs> so that I don't have to worry about this place. Well, actually, I think that I can just wall this off and as soon as a zombie can't get in, that's... No. I'm just instant siege mode. Why did I think that I need a zombie to reach here and not be able to come in? That's a bit weird, I think. Obviously, they'd head for an exit, so they could just get stuck over there trying to get in. And siege mode. Oops. Sorry. Kinda slapped you there if you are a microphone and in front of my mouth I mean what right things are trying to get in shape but <laughs> I'm not sure if they are getting in shape at all are they guard I see you're doing some killings as well like things are moving now I have another miner, one less smelter. I don't know. Really. Oh, that's quite a bit of iron ore that has not been smelted. Oh my god, am I gonna need another smelter? Regardless of whether I want to or not. I need to activate the siege mode now. And I won't be able to afford another smelter. I am afraid. And that's it, we have two arrows now. Siege mode has been activated. Right, if I do add another smelter well, the issue might be with bricks, but I don't have I don't have clay, so that wouldn't be an issue, would it? I don't think so. Well, anyhow, how much have I chosen as a cap of arrows? It better not be something stupid like three or four hundred. Oh my god! Okay, put it at six, six hundred. No, put it at 500 because you just because. Right. I I need a smelter so, and this guard is not doing anything at the moment. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What am I seeing? You are dismissed. You are to go and smelt now. Food is at zero. Um. Shit, my column is dying. My column is dying. Food usage is way too high right now. I I need arrows. Oh my god, the column is getting wiped out. How am I gonna fix this? How is this fixable even? It's not, it's not fixable. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Please don't. Please, please don't. How am I gonna recover from this? I'm at zero foot, like everyone is dying. I'm about to lose the game. I'm not gonna have any foot. Oh my god. It's over, everyone is dead. I have zero colonists now. Well, that was quick, I suppose. Like, what the hell? Of course it's gonna deactivate, there is no one alive. 22 jobs. 
Are you serious? Oh, there is no coming back from this. No, you know what? There is. Though technically, there is. Since there is no siege mode now, I have, you know, I can't come back technically. I have, I have 32 arrows, which can sort of keep me alive, and I can farm food while doing that. The amount of zombies coming in has been reduced because of no colonists, obviously. I mean, technically, there shouldn't be any zombies coming in, but there are quite a few. Well, I don't know. What what are what am I gonna do now? Oh, there is no way for me to get food. I mean, that got me some food, wheat. Am I gonna have to manually grind this now? Oh my god, that's five food. I'm gonna need like a hundred. No, not... fine. Knock the torch off. It's fine. Is this it, guys? I mean, is there... Can I come back from this? Is it possible? I mean, I'm halfway to hiring a colonist, but he's gonna need to be a guard. I will have one colonist and he's gonna be a guard. Oh my god. I need to get rid of all the jobs and everything. What? How did this happen? That was like half a second. Jesus fuck me. No, there is coming back. I'm not allowing this to be over. Everyone might have starved, but that does not mean that I cannot recover. I am still alive. I am still alive and here. And I will I will revive this colony. I will revive this colony. However, you you're not you're not very interested to see me grind wheat for forever are you so so yeah there is that hello guys thank you for watching I suppose <laughs> um, well at least there is no siege mode or anything Thank you. Can I collect this? No, I placed a torch on the berry bush. What the hell? Can I farm this? Do I have to break it? No, that does not give me any food at all. Okay, I'm not gonna replant this though. Okay. okay. Um. I have a pretty solid idea of how I'm gonna do this. <sighs> Whip your wit seeds out. You will need them. Okay. Okay, everyone. Thank you for watching. It has been an honor. All of the bobs died, but that that makes room for for more for a better generation of of colonists to appear and I suppose it just I just got overwhelmed but as I said I'm not letting this be the end of it I am gonna grind wheat like a maniac and I will revive this colony because I put a lot of time into this I mean Come on, it was like one mistake, why did this have to happen? 
I mean, not one mistake, come on, it was a series of mistakes and greets on my part. Uh, anyway, thank you for watching. I will be back with more uh, at some point after I have spent hours grinding, but yeah. Alright guys, have an awesome week. If you like the series, make sure to smack the sub button. I'm not gonna let it end like this. And yeah. Alright. Um bye.